From April to June this year, activities in the domestic economy slowed down compared to the same period last year. This has mostly been observed in the tourism, transport, manufacturing, wholesale and retail, construction as well as mining sectors due to the outbreak of COVID-19. The tourism sector suffered as a result of closed borders and airspace, while the transport sector recorded a slowdown in cargo volumes. Lower output was registered in the manufacturing sector, while real turnover in the wholesale and retail trade sector also declined. The construction sector was also severely affected, as well as the agriculture, where livestock marketing activities declined due to restocking. However, signs of improvement were observed in the communication sector. Namibia's inflation rate decelerated further during the second quarter of 2020 due to lower inflation in housing, transport and alcoholic beverages and tobacco. On the financial sector, government's total debt stock continued to increase year on year, as indicated in both the domestic and foreign borrowings. Government's total debt as a percentage of GDP has increased to 58.7% at the end of June from 49.2% last year. The Namibia dollar weakened against all major trading currencies over the year to the end of the second quarter of 2020, mainly at the back of growing concerns over the impact of COVID-19. On the international front, the global economic growth recorded a severe reduction in both the advanced economies and emerging markets and developing economies owing to the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. The Chinese economy was the only economy that recorded a positive GDP growth rate during the quarter under review. The global economy is expected to record a deeper recession this year that will add pressure on the small economies like Namibia.